Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Ergo Depot's YouTube video awesomeness. My name is Colin. We're shooting this at Ergo Depot San Francisco, and today we're going to talk about monitor arms. Now, monitor arms can get a little bit scary. There's a lot of different use cases for them, a lot of attachment options. Um, you might not even understand why you need one. So today, let's cover all of that. Monitor arms help create and control the distance between your keyboard and your monitor, and that's the vertical distance. Ideally, you're not going to be on a laptop, where if I'm on a laptop, I've got my keyboard here, and my monitor is, is glued to the laptop. My keyboard and monitor are glued together. This is the worst case scenario, I would say, except for maybe a cell phone, um, where these days people are getting text neck because they're spending all day looking down at their cell phones. So in this case, I'm stuck looking down at my laptop and my, my spine, my neck is um, not in alignment. Ideally, I could look straight ahead. So my monitor should be up here. But how do we create that distance? There's two ways and some people do it with a keyboard tray. Um, we usually recommend people use a monitor arm for a couple different reasons. Number one, you, I mean, you create that distance for one, um, but in an, Unlike a keyboard tray, you also have the ability to unlock other use cases. So you can rotate the monitor vertically. You can easily turn it to show a coworker or a neighbor something on your screen. You can make minute adjustments easily. And in getting your monitor off the desk surface, you're also unlocking a lot of desktop real estate. So you can have stacks of paper or books or your phone or your light, you can fit more on the space, you're utilizing that space better. Um, so generally I recommend a monitor arm over a keyboard tray, but you do want some way to create that vertical distance. Now, if you're on a budget, you can start off doing this with just a stack of encyclopedias. When I was in undergrad, that's exactly what I did. I had a huge honking CRT monitor and I stuck it on top of three or four encyclopedias uh, to get it up to eye level. And at the time, I didn't even really understand ergonomics, but I knew that it felt better to be looking straight ahead at my monitor versus down at my monitor. Okay, so you want a monitor arm, but you don't know which arm or what a visa mount is, and some of them just get really crazy. They look like Dr. Octopus figurines or something with arms going every which way. And it's true, you can go full Frankenstein and have arms coming off of poles in all different directions. Um, if that's what you want. If you have one monitor, you just need one monitor arm, and that's it. Now we just launched the J2 monitor arm. This is a very elegant, simple monitor arm. It does everything you need a monitor arm to do. It has a clamp mount at the base, which very easily just grips the bottom of the side of your desk like a vise. Um, which means it's easy to uninstall and move without damaging the desk surface. The next question is, will the monitor arm work with my monitor? Well, 95% of monitors have what's called a visa plate attachment on the back, which really just means there's four screw holes that are either 75 millimeters apart or 100 millimeters apart in a square. So you just wanna double check the weight of your monitor and check on our website every monitor arm we carry on the product page. You can scroll down and see what the weight class for the monitor is. So as long as your if your monitor is 10 pounds and this monitor arm can hold monitors from seven to 13 pounds, you're good to go. It'll hold it. You just need to make sure you have those four screw holes. So if you use a laptop as your main computer, as a lot of us do, you can also consider a laptop tray, which will mount to each monitor arm we carry has a laptop tray that will work with the arm. And basically, it just right here where the monitor would normally attach with the visa mount, the laptop tray attaches. And it will just hold your laptop and you can then use your laptop as a second monitor that you have up at your eye level instead of uh, down on the surface of your desk. So I use a laptop tray personally. I think that it's uh, one of the best ways to turn your laptop into a second monitor and just plug in your main monitor and use that as your dual screen setup. I hope that answers all of your questions about monitor arms and their use cases. Again, to review, if you wanna buy a monitor arm, you wanna check the weight of your monitor, confirm that it has a visa plate mount on the back, which is just those four screw holes, 
and you probably are going to want to clamp mount um, as your mounting option. Um, again, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. You can learn more at ergodepot.com or give us a call. There's a number at the top of our website you can call and get to a live human right away. We're always standing by to answer questions. This is what we do. This is what we love. So until next time, I'm Colin. Thanks for watching. Ah!